We talk to the Empress, Malice, and she says that Gillian is the one. And that we had to travel to its sanctuary to find some kind of object. Obviously, we weren't going to leave Chip in his stone state, so she gave us a concoction to help us free him, but Gillian wasted some of it. And now there's this weird snaily moss thing coming at us, and I'm not a big fan of that. Whatever it might be though, and whatever it's trying to do, we're going to have to just roll with it. everybody and welcome back to just roll with it my name is dm and i'm the grizzly thought you were gonna say markiplier my name is bisley and i play chip <laughs> my name's condy and i play jay and i'm markiplier <laughs> <laughs> and there and it is I'm, Char I'm charlie i'm charlie slimesicle and i play gillian tide strider there's a little bit of markiplier inside us all there is little, there truly is. I don't know what compelled me to start the intro. With that. There's a little bit of Wilfred in all of our wharf stashes. Let's <laughs> get the show on the road. <laughs> all right. So, where we last left off, Gillian and the Tide Striders continue their confrontation with the Empress, who offered to free Chip and Old Man Earl from their stone-bodied prisons with a magical dissolvent that she could make for the following day. In return. You three would enter some sacred temple and retrieve the special item it holds for her. After discussion and using her samples of the dissolvent for it to, to free Chip's upper body and old man Earl's bald head, <laughs> you formed an agreement with Stella, or Malice, the Empress, and made your way towards the top of the mountain. And at the end of the walkable terrain, you found a narrow opening in the stone oh, behind a gigantic waterfall. Dude, it's actually crazy that Chip didn't slap his head. Holy shit. It really is. Oh my god. Character development. Gillian threw Must Chip. Be. Speaking of Chip. Gillian threw Chip through a, like a spear through this opening. And on the other side was what Maria called the sanctuary. That yeah. led you to the entrance of the so-called temple within the mountain. The stairs leading up were crumpled. But with a few creative solutions and even with Chip's stone legs, you all climbed up and reached the top. <laughs> what is that laughing for? What is this? What is this? But what immediately, is this DM laugh? What is this? You're met with a room covered in moss and overgrown vegetation. The room inclined at a slight curve with an exit on the other side. However, the ceiling holding a glowing bulbous flower that gave the room a bright red hue and attached to it were tentacles made of vines. Its snail-like eyes detached from the ceiling to look down at you all, and the monstrous tentacles began to move towards you. And that is where we pick back up. Woo! So what do you do? Hit it with a hamburger. You don't have a hamburger. With a hamburger? Do you have a hammer, Chip? Do you have I'd, a hammer? I'd like an ice hammer. Is that what... <laughs> Did you just say that to me? <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, what are we doing? Um, so there what do you is do? a... They start to creep towards you. All uh -huh. eight of them. <gasps> okay, so I'm three of you see this. Back, your reactions beast. are really, really calm for seeing this shit. Stay am back. I, am I still being held by Gillian? Uh, up to you guys. Unless you're wig, unless you're wiggling. Uh, I Gillian I tied Strider and and also the, the chip on my shoulder <laughs> will prevent you from taking another step forward. Stop now, unless you wish to be cut down. Swish, ah! can, can you put me down? Do they look friendly? <laughs> yes. I, I, nice. I, I put them down. Do they look friendly? Inside check. <laughs> <laughs> the tentacles uh, or the eyes? <laughs> the whole situation. The whole situation. Uh, 17. <laughs> okay. They're cute. Probably. So, uh, Gillian, you didn't roll uh, inside check, right? It's just Jay? Uh, I, 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 in, I can if you want me to. Um, up to you. Either... If you sure, want to, sure. I'll, I'll see what vibe you both, I get. You both okay, said it. Okay, I got so. a three. Okay, then you don't matter. Your all doesn't matter. <laughs> Jay, you look up uh, yeah. at these bul uh, <laughs> these kind of bulging snail eyes that come down, uh -huh. and while the room is lit and this, uh, this, 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 given this red interior, it all looks menacing, but the eyes look soft, uh, and the tentacles are are just creeping slowly towards uh, your party, but not, not, not snappily. <laughs> 
to where it's lunging I towards see. you. Stay, stay back from the tentacle. I draw my I draw my sword. I want to get ready. Hey, I don't, those eyes look peaceful. They look kind. You're being they, you're they, being they, charmed, they, Jay. You're being charmed. <laughs> okay. I look at the eyes. Do they look soft and peaceful? They remind you of Pretzel's eyes. Oh shit! Okay, I put my sword away. <laughs> what, what, what is Pretzel? Why hold up Pretzel? What does Pretzel think of this? Pretzel, be the judge. Pretzel is the judge of all. <laughs> wait. I wait, to, I wait to see her opinion. Yeah, I'll roll it. Okay. Pretzel turns away from it and looks pouty at you. Well met, Pretzel. Draw my sword again. <laughs> okay. Oh, I slash off one so of the tentacles. What we, <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Right, I'll, I'll just have all of you roll initiative now. Okay. <laughs> okay. Dude, listen, it wouldn't have had to come to it if Pretzel didn't look pouty. <laughs> She Pretzel, why do you look so pouty, man? <laughs> we could have had tentacle friends or something. What does the terrain look like around this? Everything is covered is covered in this overgrown vegetation. Uh, so it's like okay. the floor is covered in grass, vines, uh, twigs, leaves. The walls are the same way. From It looks like a room, like you're inside of a giant leaf. <laughs> uh, oh, so yeah. you can't really see any stone uh, beneath the floor or anything like that. And on the top is this uh, this, this creature, this monstrosity. Is it, is it attached to the ceiling? Yes. Okay. Kind of looks glued to it. How high up is the ceiling exactly? I would say the ceiling is about as high as like a normal house ceiling. Uh, so about 15 feet. Sweet. I got a 15 on initiative. I okay. got a 16. I oh. got a 19. Okay. Uh, let me write it down. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. So highest is Chip with a 19. The second highest is J. A. A. 16. Uh, Gillian, go ahead and roll your attack since you did. I'll let you do that first, but you will go last in the initiative. Oh, sure. Okay. Uh, Let's fucking swing it, baby. See if you 19, roll 19 to hit. The hit rolls your damage. Okay. It does. Uh, Just eight slashing damage. You... Notice that when you, you slice through a little bit of the vines, uh, but it doesn't completely detach or sever it in half. Uh, this one, they're pretty uh, thick, a thick bundle, uh, yeah. at least for this. But it does, you know, cut off uh, the bit. There's like remnants of the vine that like detach and fall down into the ground and mix with the vegetation on the floor. Next up, for the first top of the round, I have the as these uh, <laughs> these tentacles are, are creeping towards you guys, Chip. What would you like to do in your stone? <clears throat> okay, stone legged. So. I first want to know if I would know anything about this creature, uh, if if I might have seen it before, heard of it before. Mm-hmm. I believe that's a history check, right? Okay, I will roll it that. It should be. You. I think so. Yeah. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Doing knowledge. About right. ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. knowledge. That is a history. 19. Okay. Uh, this creature, you wouldn't have seen it or, or read about it, but... It does appear to be sort of, uh, it looks similar to a very large plant like snail. Okay. But it's not it, a creature that you could name. And does it, uh, w would I, with this, would I know anything about like how it's, it's body is made up and what it controls? Like would I know that maybe it could, it could control the vegetation around us or or anything like that. From from you uh, like looking over and inspecting, you can immediately tell that the only vegetation that it is controlling are the eight of uh, uh, bundles of vines that form its its tentacles that, that come uh, from that that red bulbous flower okay. and and kind of <clears throat> it spreads out like a network, almost like an octopus. Okay. Here's, uh, it here's comes what down off the it. ceiling. Um, these these little tentacles coming down at us. Could I possibly get a hold of one of these from where I'm at? And if not, could I hobble towards one? Yes, you could. Yeah, absolutely. All right. So I want to attempt to jump up and grab onto one of these and try and move forward and slash at the uh, at the center. Okay, roll. Pull myself up, essentially. Um, or swing on it if I could, maybe detaching the part of it touching the ground and to use it like a swing. I need you to either roll an athletics or acrobatics check. Okay. What's you good at? What's you good at? Hmm, acrobatics, that's gonna be a 15. Okay, total? Yep. So, Chip, as you grab on to one of these, uh, these vines, you hobble over, 
um, basically one of its tentacles, uh, you try to swing from it, and while it does swing at first across uh, across this room, and once you try to let go, you notice that the vine has completely wrapped around your 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 lower uh, body, uh, and it has oh. now grappled you into position. So when okay. you let go, your body just kind of falls forward, and you're being held up uh, oh. and moved upwards towards the this creature. Was there any way that I could get a swing in on the? Uh, your the action part would be. Uh, would be to do this. Well, what about the bonus action attack? Go for it. Mm. I'll let you. I'll let you try and attack it if you want. Okay, fourteen hit. Yep, that hits. Sweet, and that's going to do. I do. Do I still get the plus three? I keep forgetting. On the bonus. On your bonus attack, I, I don't believe so. No. Okay, so that's a six. Okay. Yeah. Uh, same thing. You're able to slash a bit. As you saw Gillian do, uh, a bit of the vines that it's holding, but it doesn't release its grasp on you, uh, and it doesn't seem to like uh, sever. And okay. your your movement is now reduced to zero. So unless you have any other actions that you can take, this is that's the end of your turn. Um, nope. I think that's gonna end my turn. Okay. You guys see Chip uh, hobble over, grab one of the the vines, and then try and <laughs> swing from it. But as it does, you watch the vine uh, kind of. A little bit at a quicker pace, wrap around his legs and his lower torso, and he becomes grappled, and he's just kind of suspended, uh, being slowly moved up towards uh, basically the serrated teeth inside of that that bulbous flower on the ceiling. Uh -oh. so, it's got gentle eyes, up. though. It's great. It has gentle eyes. It's, I'm sure it's, it'll be it's, fine. <laughs> it's a very gentle creature, who am I kidding? <laughs> Next up is Jay. Teeth. Jay, what's, what's, what are you doing on your turn? I'm going to try to shoot Chip down, I guess. Okay. Uh, roll a hit. With my longbow. Uh, 15. All right. Roll your damage. And damage is going to be a fat nine straight through. So, I, yeah, I'm like, yeah, it's got gentle eyes. Oh, f fuck it. Okay. <laughs> it's going to eat me. <laughs> you uh, you shoot right above uh, Chip's head, kind of like a threading a, an apple, as if it were, like an imaginary apple on top of his head. It goes straight through... Um, one of the stronger uh, vines uh, that, that of this bundle that severs it immediately. Um, mm -hmm. Kind of uh, basically knocking one of these tentacles off this creature. Uh, you hear a, a, a very soft oh. as, uh, oh. <laughs> as the tentacle severs oh, and chip it makes me feel bad. falls no. to the floor. <laughs> uh, and that, that, that uh, tentacle just starts to kind of uh, crumble, uh, not like decaying, but to the point where it's starting to blend in with the vegetation on the floor. Oh, Jay, oh, that feel... didn't make me feel good. Maybe we should have let it eat Chip. Chip, it feels bad now. <laughs> Chip, it needs to be fertilized. <laughs> I'm, I'm like okay, super in tune with this plant. Uh, okay. No. I, have I? Am I not grappled anymore? Did he shoot? Was Jay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're okay. not grappled anymore. Now here's the question. Am I? It is not your turn. Am I on the ground, like not able to stand because I don't have legs? You, would, you would essentially. <laughs> Roll a, roll a deck save. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, and my boom. God. Okay, it's a 22. Then you land uh, feet first, and uh, oh, you wobble so back funny. and forth a bit, but then you sort of balance yourself out. So you're standing, um, not able to, like, move very well on your own, but, you, yeah, you're just standing right up, straight up. Let's go. Uh, Jay, do you move at all or have a bonus action that you'd like to do? Uh, no, I think... Uh... I'm gonna chill. Do I have a bonus action I wanna do? I'm gonna Hunter's Mark the. I'm guessing the eyes, whatever the eyes is connected to, because I feel like that's the main body. The eyes seem to be. Um, they, they sort of. Their origin point. Uh -huh. make, a, make a perception check. Uh, perception plus three. I feel so wrong 21. hitting this thing, guys. Me too. I don't like it. Why do I feel bad for. It's attacking us, I think. <laughs> I know. I don't really know. So 21, if you didn't catch it. Yeah, yeah, I didn't. Uh, yeah, you can see uh, while the the ends of the eyes, it's our origin point, is kind of blending in with the, the vegetation on the ceiling. You can see that it does kind of uh, basically come from that red bulbous flower. Uh-huh. Uh, okay. And that's your turn? So then... You hunters mark yeah, that? Yeah, so I'm going to hunters mark, yeah, the, the bulbous flower, I guess. Gotcha. Oh, I feel so bad, though. <laughs> all right, you do so, Gillian, your turn, unless Jay moves. You move at all. I do not move, no, I'm gonna stand still. Alrighty then. I, I T-pose and spot assert dominance upon this creature. Okay, alright, alright. Watch the shmoo, Gillian. Here's the shmoo! I wanna, I wanna, listen, it clearly just wants food. It, it just, 
It wants something from us, but I do not think its intentions are unjust. I want to, I want to jump up at the mouth, just grab on and and create cast create water just into the mouth. I want to water <laughs> this plant water and see if, 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 if that'll if that'll work. I just don't want to hurt it because it seems like it's not evil. Okay. Oh, every every um, indication is not evil, and I don't know if, if Grizzly expected us to not attack the plant. Okay, I jump, I jump into its mouth, and instantly create ten gallons of water inside of it. So, yeah. in order to do this, um, drink. You'll have to move up since the room kind of is going uh, at an upward slope. You have to move up to get under it. And then jump up uh, and 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 try and bring the water, uh, or at least create water from the briefcase. I'm assuming that's what you're trying to do. No, no, no. It's it's a it's a. Or just create. Um, oh, so there's, where does the water? A, I'm sort of from? using. I'm using the spell create or destroy water, and okay, I'm just okay. creating water. It would be oh, so right. funny if I was sitting there like trying to get my balance, and as I was finally balanced, you went up and jumped off of my shoulder, and I fell over again. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the it has to be uh, in an open container. When is you... its mouth an open container? <laughs> it's not a container, <laughs> and the way gravity works, it would fall. <laughs> Fuck! Okay, I, I, I instead, uh, I, I use it as rain in a cube, so I water its vines. Okay. And I move sure. away from the vines, so they're further away from me. Okay, so you'd be moving back uh, towards yeah. where you guys came from? Back towards the entrance. And also, it's, it's just one the, last just thing, if you'll let me. Uh, is there an exit in this room, or is it? Is there nothing? It's the way you came down. The, the stairs that you climbed up? There's no other exit? No. I mean, at the end, very end of the room, you have to walk under uh, uh, under the bulbous plant, essentially. Like, where Chip is in the middle of the room now, past him, there's that exit that, that is at the very end of this uh, curved incline of a room. So it kind of moves like this. Uh, if you can see my hand motion. Sorry, audio okay. listeners. Okay, okay. So just to <laughs> confirm, there's the bulbous Ooh. plant, the bulbous plant, and then there's also the mouth and eyes that are separate? There's no mouth. There's the bulbous plant that bloomed uh, and opened up to show uh, rows and rows of teeth inside okay, of it. Okay, that's what I thought. And that's what I thought. attached to it are the two snail-like eyes that came down to look at all of you. God, I just don't want to hurt it, man. I just don't <laughs> want to. And I don't know why. I just, and I water it. I water it and walk away. And that ends right. my turn. Okay. As you make it rain in this vicinity, uh, all of the plants, and including you guys, Jay and, and Chip, you guys bring it let us pass. Very, very wet. Uh, the hue of this bulbous oh. plant uh, goes from a, a red to a blue. And it will take its turn. Oh. As, it's uh, eat you. It's consumed you. Wow, this and, is either really good or really bad. Uh, Jay, where you stood, where were you, like... I didn't move. Not an inch. Okay, but where, where would you have ended your turn? Because So, Gillian walked back to where you guys first arrived, uh, uh -huh. which is, like, at the very edge uh, I would have basically seat. like right in the, the entrance, like probably I'm gonna say ten feet forward before, yeah, we we got okay. anywhere. Okay. So um. All right. I'll say that. Chip, roll uh, roll another athletics or acrobatics check. It's okay, okay, Chip. I've watered it. He's 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 quenched. Uh, nineteen. That's total. Yep. I rolled uh, really high. I rolled 18. So. Uh, oh, thank God the plant's not. The plant that's trying to kill us isn't thirsty anymore. With the, it has such gentle eyes. <laughs> its eyes are so gentle. Look at it. So it doesn't, it doesn't have evil eyes. Do I With think the it looks gentle? What I. Does it. <laughs> it's trying to eat you. Currently yeah, I, I see the so, teeth. The, the, as, um, the mall. As another oh one gosh, of its. I can't do it. I can't do it. As another one of its uh, tentacles. Uh, starts to wrap around your body again, uh, Chip. You feel yourself lifted up uh, as you're, you're grappled once again. Go ahead and make a... Just make a perception check. Okay. It's just... It just, it just wants to look at you. It just wants to lick you. It just and wants... It is, and it is, like it is your turn next, by the way, Chip. It's just like a pet. It wants to uh, give you 18, smooches. 18 on that uh, perception <laughs> check. Okay, yeah. You notice that uh, while it is res restraining you in a way where it is grabbing you, the actual tension, the pressure of the vines, when it lifts you up the second time, it feels gentle. Jay, can we agree if it tries to eat Chip, we, uh, it's evil? Yeah, if yeah, it I think that... We're good? 
I, I think we're good if it doesn't no, try no, to hang eat on. Chip. Yeah. I don't think it's I don't think it's trying to eat me. Hey, are you trying to eat me? I don't, I don't know response. if we can speak <laughs> common. Pretzel, we may need a second appraisal on this one. <laughs> <laughs> do you do you walk up to it and show Pretzel it again? It's not my turn, so. I'm just asking if you're going to do that. <laughs> Potentially. <laughs> okay. Chip, what do you do? Um. You're raised up again a second time. Mm. <laughs> Dude, I'm like, I fucking God, I can't wait. There's combat, and you say it has gentle eyes, and I'm like, ah, I don't... I'd like, no. I can I roll insight check on this thing? See its intentions. It's a plant. I think it's a plant. It's a yeah, plant. that's what uh, has my problem here. You can roll. You can roll an insight <laughs> check. Dude, I say you just let this thing take you and see where the wind, you know, see where the wind blows. <laughs> Worst case, it like chomps on you a little bit. But then we know. But that there's nothing worse than not knowing. Like I can't live with guilt if we kill this thing and it and it doesn't like even hit us. The only thing that I'm shocked by is that nobody has tried to just walk through the room. <laughs> I need to know what's going on. With this. <laughs> there's a bull. There's a big bull in the way. Didn't, I, I didn't expect you guys to be like so. <laughs> there's a huge bull in the way of the door. I didn't realize right? it was gonna be a fucking moral dilemma. No, he's on the ceiling. Oh, what? Oh. It's the ceiling and the, the tentacles bulb? are coming down from it. Oh, dude, I was stressed because I was like, I, can, I, wanna, I thought I had to cut down the bulb to get through the door and I don't wanna. No, you just have to move past its tentacles. Oh okay, my God. so okay. I'm okay. being I'm being <laughs> raised up right now. Yes. Hey, what do plants eat? Water, um, sunlight, <laughs> uh, what? Like fertilizer? Does anybody have any fertilizer? Technically fish are great fertilizer. Fish poop is. Do you know that? Well, you got, do you gotta go right now? D depending on how drastic things get. <laughs> Maybe. Um, I hope it doesn't come to that. Can I shit as a free action? <laughs> uh, I'd like uh, yeah, dude, go for it. I'd like to ready an action to cut myself loose if I feel that this is going in a direction of my demise. It needs to but, draw blood before we can kill it. I, I, I but, just, yeah, <laughs> but like, I, yeah, I'll wait for any indication of that. Otherwise, I'll just let it do what it's. No, do. we don't need an indication. We need it to happen. We I need, can't. We I need can't blood deal with the half truth. I need it to hurt us. <laughs> so you end your turn, ready an action to attack if you feel if you get attacked, basically, right? Well, I, I'm not attacking per se, just freeing myself. And, uh, ready and Chip, freeing Jay, myself. I am so uncomfortable. Okay. All right, okay. then uh, next up, Jay. I don't know what to do. Jay, you watch the uh, Chip is rose, ri risen. He's being lifted up again by the same, uh, the seventh vine tentacle. Now only seven because you caught one of them. So what do you do? I don't know. <laughs> Chip, <just> do something. <laughs> It's okay, Jamie. Do you know what I mean? You're you're right, 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 right. Right. I, don't know. I just feel it's bad. Right. I feel bad. Right. Hug. Why are you hugging? Plants are good. Why are these plants bad? I just thought that plants were always good, and this one has such soft, soft eyes. Stop crying. I think it's fine. It's soft eyes. It has chip and a gentle grasp. What does it want? Hello. <laughs> what I wouldn't give to speak to you. <laughs> I'd like to communicate with plants. Can you do that? do that? I can't. No. Oh shit, dude! I was like, you're a ranger. Maybe you have that spell. I was gonna scream if you could do that. I'm distraught. I'm distraught. I'm passing my uh, turn, being distraught. You can't pass your turn. You can't no. pass your turn. Yeah. I walk through the room. I walk through the room. Touch it, Jay, touch it, stomata. I touch what? the stomata What's gently. A stomata? What's a stomata? It. It's Fifteen plant. feet up. It's the stomata would hang down. The stomata is like the part in the middle the bees get pollen from. That is, yeah. Duh. Yeah, duh, <laughs> guys, come on. This is Jay. insane. This is what happens if you don't if you don't give us enough things to fight in the campaign. We're gonna see one thing and just we're so scared. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Just okay. Here, Chip, you should don't put the ball away. You put again? the ball. It's okay. He's no, all it's right. No, cool. it's my friend. Uh, okay. I think. I'm just gonna walk through the room then. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. And see if it grabs me. I accept it. It's loving embrace. <laughs> I hope this is how we all die. <laughs> okay. Uh, we're gonna get to the final boss. Chris is gonna say he has soft eyes, and then we're gonna get TVK. <laughs> <laughs>
It's um, the worst possible thing you could have told me. <laughs> the the vines are, are 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 moving slow enough to where when you're walking through the room, currently as is not uh, the creature's turn, it's not gonna go for a grapple as you begin to walk. However, Why not? Uh, I do what need you to want? make. What does he want? <laughs> I do need you to make a dexterity saving throw. Yeah, sure, sure, what does he sure. Want? Uh, twenty-three. As you begin walking through the room. Your foot sinks in a little more than it should, and you hear a click. And the floor that you're standing on folds downwards as you begin to fall into a pit. And you flip over to look, and you see you're headed straight towards a bunch of spikes. You maneuver your body in such a way mid-air to where you're not caught directly on one of them, and you fall into the ground just in between them and get a little scraped up. You take half of eight points of damage, which is four piercing damage. Fuck! <laughs> hey, you guys okay? Spikes! Spike pit! <laughs> Oh! <laughs> At this point, um... Hey Chip, I think you had a good a good go of it. We should totally yeah. not give the thing in here to that lady. Yeah, it was part of my plan. Gillian, you see, you see Jay just start to walk across uh, into the room past the vines, which don't go for a grapple just yet, and then... She just falls into a pit. <laughs> and at this point, uh, uh, it is your turn now. Uh, cause Jay, there is... Uh, unless you want to try and do anything else, um, you can still take your can action. I, I will say, uh, but you basically can, I, have to, can uh, I try to maneuver myself out of the pit at this point? The pit with an action is is there's no way <laughs> there's no way to get out uh, via movement uh, at this time. <laughs> okay, I know what we gotta do. Especially gotta because do. you you've used movement to move up. You have to use half your movement to stand up. You would have not enough movement at all to try and climb up. Okay, out okay, here. okay, that makes sense. But if you have an action or anything that you wanted to do, you can. And I got nothing. Okay, uh, Gillian, it's your turn. You notice that uh, the floor is gone as a lot of the vegetation that was on it sinks into the pit, uh, falling on top of Jay and then into the spikes. And the only remaining uh, area to stand in is where you are and the little raised platform that's in front of the exit at the end of the room. Okay, so I need to get from, how far is it from here to the exit? It is about 50, or 50? 50, or, 50 or so feet long, yes. It's 50 feet of spikes? Yes. Long. What the fuck? I'm sorry if I didn't uh, explain how long the room was at first. <laughs> that's a, that's did a you lot say of it was like? Did you say it was like a quarter circle room? It, it, like it does the... curve up. Uh, it, it's an incline and curves uh, sort of like a slope uh, that goes okay. up. Okay, you know you what? See you on know the, what? On the... Yeah. <sighs> Maybe the vines... Maybe it's trying to take us across. <laughs> I want to... <laughs> I, 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 I jump... I jump into its embrace. Okay. I Maybe. jump across. I jump across and into one of the vines hanging okay. down, and I grab onto it, and I and I wait to be caressed and gently brought over to the other side. You're allowing yourself to be willingly grappled, essentially. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I okay. am. I water to you. In that case, I let uh, you grow, and now you must let us you grow jump, as well. You cling on. Oh, one you know of what? The um, I also, as as my action, if I'm if I'm holding onto this, if I'm letting it grab me. I want to uh, I want to toss down my rope as my actual action at um, at Jay. So if it you know while it's moving around, she can climb up to the vine that I'm at. All right. So I toss down my rope. Okay. Yeah. Use the rope that uh, that you are originally going to use to help uh, Chip get up the steps and and let it dangle down um, gently. You feel as well. The vines that you grappled onto cling to as you jumped start to wrap around your legs and your waist uh, and a bit of your torso. And sort of like a harness, it wraps around uh, your body. And uh, you begin to slowly uh, rise as well. And that's okay. the end of your turn. Yeah. Jay? Yeah. The creature takes its turn. And you see next she to you <laughs> the severed tentacle that, that you shot damage, off. Steal damage. Come <laughs> just on. kind of uh, just kind of split amongst the spikes. Um, <clears throat> and uh, one of the eyes. Uh, while it's looking, it kind of uh, sw swivels around to see the other two who are being lifted up, and then they start to move in the direction of the exit. I knew it! Holy shit! Oh, oh my god! My god. <laughs> and you see another tentacle coming down in your direction. I'm just eating peanuts. I got peanuts now. Seeming to <laughs> almost magically grow in length to reach down to the pit Oh my at god, the I was so right. You were so gentle. I'm so sorry for shooting an arrow at you. <laughs> yeah, Jay, what the we fuck? Knew, we knew it had gentle eyes. If you would resist... <laughs> if you would resist the grapple, 
Let me know. But if not, it's going to basically try and grab I don't. Leo. I surely don't. Okay. <laughs> then you yeah. as well in this harness, uh, this vine-like harness get wrapped up and you're lifted uh, out of the spike trap. I thought I was never going to get out The three of, of you s see yourselves all uh, being suspended by uh, this, this monster's uh, tentacles. And it turns its eyes to look at all of you. And it sort of uh, elongates, same as the vines, uh, and, and kind of just follows you. And as all of you are, are, are basically carried uh, and set down on the platform in front of the exit, and the vines slowly retreat. No, 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 don't, don't go yet. I, I, I take one. I take one gingerly. I want to use uh, lay on hands. I want to try and heal it for some of the damage we did. Um, <laughs> I want to try okay. and heal it. I'm going to heal it for, I'm going to heal it for uh, six, six points. Of healing. Okay, good to know. You'll grow back thicker. The grow eyes. So you're a good plant. You're such a good plant. I love you. <laughs> plant. Slowly so and with like a like a like a like almost like a wet sound from all the rain, just close and blink a little bit, and you hear a. In the in the just roll, what if I'll I'll shit on you for fertilizer? I swear. <laughs> no. So, how much I damage did, did did Jay take from this this thing uh, from this? I've ta I've taken four, four, four from that at this point. Mm. Okay, yeah, I, I I will I will also uh, I will also say, oh, seems you were bruised up as well. I uh, I put my hand on Jay's shoulder. Um, I'm gonna heal you for, um, heal you for four. I thought I was never getting out of there. I couldn't climb the walls. There was no way I could climb the walls. I know, I know. I thought we were going to be stuck here with its, its gentle eyes forever. Never knowing. Me too. Never knowing what was right. Fuck. <laughs> okay. It's okay. The next thing in here I really hope just explicitly says, I'm evil, and then draws an axe and attacks us because that... Me too. It's just too much. Me too. I need. I need to attack something actually evil at this point. Me too. So bad. Come on, I mean, ship. We can still attack it. I mean, no, what? No, 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 let's go. Ship, let's go. No. So I didn't. What? Ship. What did you say? You said I ready. I ready in action to push him into the spike pit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Jesus joking. Christ. The sword down. <laughs> Me too. I'm also joking. Bye, Gertie. And I start wobbling. Is that what you Bye, named Gertie. it? That's a cute name. Gertie. Okay. Bye, Gertie. <laughs> You guys yeah, here. Um, we got we got we got some some together time up there. I reach up. I reach up and tickle its stamen on the way out. <laughs> At this point, that word. part of the plant. <laughs> Why do you know so many plant what words? Is this terminology. Uh, piss, you don't know about the pistols and stamens. What did... yeah, I just forgot about it. I knew. I learned about it in like ninth grade bio biology. You know, like yeah, for sure. I'm like waddling through this door. <laughs> so, you said girdle was what you named it. Gertie. I like, I Gertie? like Gertie. Gertie. Okay, yeah. okay. You guys hear uh, Gertie give a small, soft groan as its uh, its color of the of the flower, the bulbous flower, goes from blue as it was being watered back to red, and then the glow dims, causing this chamber to darken. That's awesome. Chip, let's and out in front out, of you, also a... <laughs> okay. Ooh. Such a good girl. Chip, the way I in front of you, you could speak so many languages. Yeah, Chip, uh, where did you learn how to speak plant? Uh, we'll go over it, Jay. I can do a lot of things that you don't know about, all right? Maybe it's time you start giving me some credit. Hello, everybody. My name is Markiplier, and welcome to the mid-roll. It's not true. My name's Fiction. <laughs> I'm really sorry to let you all down like that. I know you, you were excited for, for the mid-roll featuring Markiplier, but he just... Couldn't he ghosted me? He couldn't be here today, and, and that's really sad, you know. So, so I guess you could say that Markiplier really let me down. But you know who wouldn't let me down? You wouldn't, because I know you're actually already a patron for Just Roll with It. And if you aren't, then it's so easy to do, and you won't let me down. Think of it. The perks are that I won't be sad. You don't want to see me sad. I don't want to see me sad. It, everybody wins. And I also get five fucking dollars. Woo! But what do you get out of this? Well, my, my undying happiness, sure. But you also get an entire new... Patreon exclusive campaign! 
That's right. You heard it right here. First, folks, uh, we, we are doing a, a, a Just Roll with a Patreon exclusive campaign called Prime Defenders. We're already 10 episodes deep. How have you not heard of it yet? What the fuck? Listen, all you have to do is go to patreon.com and put in your funny credit card numbers and pay us $5 every single month or even just one month if you really just wanted to watch all 10 episodes in one month and then stop it. But you shouldn't do that because if we get to 10k, we get to do IRL content. And IRL content means just roll with it in real life. And it also means slimesicle content with everybody else in real life. Uh, it also means me content with everybody else in real life. It means grizzly content with everybody else. Bizly con so much fucking content! So give us money, okay? Bye. The way in front of you is uh, a set of curved stairs, sort of following uh, the curve, uh, the curvature of this room, what that this room was uh, leading into. Uh, and there's a very faint glimmer of yellow around the corner. And I assume you'll start to go? Of course, yeah, I, I, I yeah. walk with Jay, uh, turn back and realize I didn't take Jib with me. Um, <laughs> As I'm like a ho hobbling. You, you good? Can you? Yeah, I'll, I'll get there. Um, yeah, you can make stuff with ice. Could you make me like some ice sticks? Like walk? I should be able to. I I, I, I uh, open Clorton's <laughs> infinite briefcase and draw <laughs> some draw some water out and basically just create these like ice crutches for him. Simple ice crutches. All right. Yo. Sweet. And I start well, like well, you've, moving myself. You have, you have about an hour before those melt away. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker looking like Rover from Percy Jackson now. <laughs> 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 All right. So you, you guys, if you could, you could probably do quite a lot of damage with those legs like that. Huh. I didn't even think about it. Just don't. All right. Give it a break. When we fight, battering ram legs. If it is, if it explicitly says it's evil, if it has gentle eyes. What's with you in the eyes? Gentle eyes, gentle eyes is a different it's story. We can't eyes. attack the gentle eyes. Okay, the next thing that is directly evil, battering ram legs. That's right, that's right. That's good, I like that. Okay, like okay. And the next thing that is directly evil, I, Gillian Tidestrider, declare shall be in this very next room. I open the door. Is it What's evil? The next room? So there's, there's, <laughs> there's no doors that you open. You basically just follow the steps. Uh, all of you travel up the steps together. And as you come to the end of these steps, they lead into another chamber. The ground is covered in grass with uh, small flowers blooming. Um, and it's, surround it's surrounding a sparkling pond in the middle of the room. And you see the room itself is lit by tall sunflowers in each corner, giving the area a golden glow which is mixing with the blues reflecting from the pond. It almost feels like you're outside now. It's confusing because you know you're not. You know you're inside the mountain, but it feels like you're being hit by the rays of sunshine in a field contained into the small uh, chamber. And on the opposite wall, across from this pond, you see a chalk-like drawing into the black stone. Two humanoid figures looking at each other, one standing up and the other kneeling. And that's what you see as you come into this room. I'd like to walk over to one of the sunflowers, look at it, kind of poke it, and go, hmm. Just make noises at it. <laughs> see if it's see if it's sentient. <laughs> make a make a nature check. Okay. <laughs> I'm not saying she said it. I'm not. That's a six. Uh, there is no response from the sunflower. Okay, can I make a deception check to make Jay think I'm speaking to it? Uh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you guys can. You just have to roll insight, uh, Jay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Nineteen. I have bad insight. Eleven. My God, he's speaking to that flower, Jay. <laughs> Jay, come here. Wow, wow. Come here. What is it saying? Hmm. It said. Hmm. What? What is that? Hmm. Oh, Jay. Yeah? I'm, What's it saying? I'm sorry, Jay. The flower, the flower doesn't like your hair. Oh. I cut what? the flower. <laughs> Rolled ahead. Mm. What's that little ball? Flower. 14. Let's go. It's a flower. Roll your damage. No gentle eyes, time to die. That's what they say. Six. There's no eyes in this one. Six. <laughs> With your short sword and a <laughs> yep. yeah, yeah, a very uh, flashy swipe, you snap, you sever this sunflower in half, and the light that it was giving off 
It was evil. And just darkens, and you kill the sunflower. Perfect. And this corner of the room was, was a little dark. Yeah. The flower was evil. Okay, I, I use I use my divine sense to detect good and evil in this room. <laughs> Anything within sixty feet. I leave it one. That was fire. I, I'm gonna. I, what, what, I'm gonna know what flowers are evil. What flowers he are had evil? A family. There is uh, oh, no. Maybe you should have thought twice. You're not I, wanna, any, I can't uh, deal in grace. I can't deal in grace. Where's the evil? Where's the evil? I want to <laughs> point over to some of the smaller flowers and look at Jay and say, "You orphaned his children." <laughs> <laughs> and I want to look it down at them and go, "Are they talking about my hair?" <laughs> You're a monster. <laughs> Bloodlust fills my eyes. <laughs> no, like... no, 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 no. Still under the effects of Hunter's Mark. <laughs> um, what was? What's the? I'm trying to look for it, Gillian. What's the good when you're detecting the good? Uh, okay, so how anything. it actually works is until the end of your next turn, you can sense anything affected by the Hollow spell or know the location of any celestial fiend or undead within 60 feet that is not behind total cover. So it, you know, it says you can detect good and evil, but that is kind of what it does. Right. Uh, no, you don't get any pings from any evil or any hollow spells or anything undead or anything like that. Okay. Right. Nothing in this room like that. I'm sorry, small friends. Um, I'll take care of you now. I want to pick up the little flower and just hold it in the, and have the soil <laughs> in the hand. <laughs> I, walk over, I walk over to the, the chalk painting and accidentally step on them. This is my... The flower? <laughs> Uh, he, yeah, I walk, I walk over to like the, the, the chalk drawing and, and on the way I accidentally just step on the flowers on the way over. This is my <laughs> son now. <laughs> no! <laughs> Should you hear the crunching of the stem? <laughs> <laughs> my beautiful boy. Oh, sorry. I, I lean down, I poke it and use one point of, uh, of lay on hands. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a dead flower. There's no feeling it. No! Oh, you killed it! <laughs> No! I... No, it was dead when it got cut in half. <laughs> oh. Oh, were, were these, these were the children. These, these were, the were the children. These are the children. These are the children. Yeah. No, you stepped the, on the children. I stepped on the, the children. small flowers at the, at the... Oh! Oh, like just the mm -hmm. small flowers that yeah, were coming was, out of the ground. Yeah, okay, sorry. I missed, I thought you were I'm still talking about the sunflowers. Up. Okay, yeah. And he kills my son. <laughs> just, yeah, you would just I step on the small flowers in the ground. The same as stepping on grass. Oh God, what have I done? I walk <laughs> over to I walk over to the uh, the uh, ins inscription or or it's just a, yeah, it or... looks like a chalk drawing. Just okay. the outlines of two humanoids, one kneeling, it... one, one standing. kneeling, one standing. Yep. Uh, is there another exit to this room at all? No. It's just this pool of water. Yes. Okay, you two try and kneel or stand or something. I don't know if kneeling is gonna work right now, but I can give it a I shot. Kneel, I kneel. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna jump in the water and start looking down there for her stuff. Gillian, as you approach the water, make a wisdom saving throw. Fuck! <sighs> is Gillian wise? A little bit. 18. Okay. Yeah, uh, you walk up to the pond, jump in, and, and start swimming down. It's, it's gets darker as you keep going. It's a little deeper than expected, uh, but you can still see fairly easily. And you start to swim down. What are the other two do? As a Gillian, right. you guys just hear, you guys hear him basically jump Woo! into this pool. What do you All guys right. do? Hope there's no evil down here. He's, he's probably <laughs> fine. I look over at Jay. He's probably are okay. You, are you like mimicking the the uh, the drawing with me? Yeah, yeah. I, I I kneel. What are you doing? I'm mimicking the drawing. Oh, it's almost like I'm knighting you. And I grab my sword that's, and no, I put on No, that's the thing my, that, uh, no, I, don't knight I me. puff out my chest. <laughs> that's too much responsibility. <laughs> I chip knight the Jay Farron. Oh, God. Knight of dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you you would have that ability, you, wouldn't you? Okay. Hey, don't look at me. I'm not the knight of dumbass. <laughs> well, you're the knighter of dumbass. So. That's, a dumb, that's a knight of dumbass thing to say. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> hey, is, you know what? I'm leaning over and I like I have no bearing on my legs, so I'm like leaning over and kind of wobbling a little bit and looking Oh god, if you fall pool. in that is so bad, dude. Okay. You, have a, you are half you are half rock. You go in, you go and look I mean, into the the pond for Gillian? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm like leaning over and Jay is just oh, looking at me. I'm sure the temptation is there. Okay. It surely is. I it's the first thing that came to my head. 
To be true, to be truthful. I'm looking over my balance. Is, I'm not. I'm not paying attention to you. I'm well, Chip, go ahead and make a wisdom saving throw. Sure. That was Chip's wisdom, actually. Minus one. It's my lowest oh. stat. Oh, good. Oh, right. Good, this good, is how you good, turn to stone. Good. Fourteen. This is. This is how that happened. So that just fails to save. Oh, okay. <laughs> what am I being saved from? Chip, as you hobble over and sort of uh, uh, look over into the pond to see what Gillian is doing or, or where hey, he Chip, is. Be careful over there. You Chip, catch fine. a glimpse of your reflection. Fuck. And at this point, when you meet your own gaze, you begin to fall madly in love with yourself. Oh, no. And you don't want to stop looking at yourself. And you only want to talk <laughs> about how much you love yourself. As, as I was saying this, Jay, I'm fine. I'm super fine. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that. I like the cut, yeah. Look at you. Oh my God, Mr. get your Hansen. head out of your ass, it's Chip. Not, oh, it's not in my ass. <laughs> but I got a nice one of those too. <laughs> Oh, Chip, 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 you would try to like move your your head to, uh, to look at your ass, but you're you just do not want to avert your gaze on yourself. And <laughs> Jay, Chip actually looks like another stone statue, except this time he's just petrified, looking at himself. <laughs> hey, Chip, what's? I stand up and I go over to him. Chip, what's wrong? I put my hand on my shoulder. <laughs> on his shoulder. Do you also oh, look into the reflection? Wrong. I look down to see what he's looking at. Yes. Wisdom save. <laughs> <laughs> Four. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I do what I have to. I do what I have to. You walk over. You put your this hand on his shoulder. This is hilarious. You look over to see what he's looking at, and you catch the reflection of yourself right above <laughs> Chip. Oh shit! And you begin you're right. to fall, I am fall <laughs> madly in love with yourself. You don't want to stop looking at yourself, and you don't want to stop talking about how much you love yourself. Not as fine as me. Oh, no. Chip, no, no. I don't think you've seen me before. I'm smoking. Jay, you're literally a pile of trash <laughs> compared to me. Here? I don't even know how people see you Is it hot in here? Is it just me? me? You're fucking ugly. My God. Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> you're, not talking. you're not even talking about yourself. You're talking about me being ugly. Well, next to me, you're Asshole. fucking ugly. I'm beautiful. <laughs> I Shut look the good. fuck up. You look like a fucking shoe stain. You're literally a pile of garbage that got put in a disposal and eaten you by a bear like a... and shit out in the woods. <laughs> you look like an old booger. <laughs> and as, as you guys are saying this, your Maybe eyes are glossed booger. over That's... and just sparkling looking at yourselves. <laughs> Petrified in the state. This is... <laughs> Mm. Are we are we supposed to keep going? What else? What else can I say? I'm, dude, I'm, I'm, hot, I'm so not going to say so shit. This is so fucking <laughs> funny to me. <laughs> you are just you are just literally eternally like, oh god, I'm so hot. I'm so hot. Holy I'm so shit. fucking hot. Mm. Holy yeah, you shit, want, I look fucking good, Jay. You look like a fucking oh, skunk shit. asshole next to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Oh man. Oh, yeah, I'm you so must be fucking really hot. You look like you climbed out of the primordial. Mm -hmm. Fuck you. Mm -hmm. You must be really insecure about <laughs> That's yourself, rough, especially man. standing next to me. Oh, this spell has baby. nothing. This, this, this doesn't make you guys hate each oh, other. Baby. That's why this is so <laughs> <That's> funny. <laughs> funny. <laughs> All right. I think it was always Jay, just that. Jay, do you frown in the mirror? Hmm. No, I don't. <laughs> oh yeah, up. I'm looking good. Gillian. <laughs> Mm. No, dude, no, dude, Jay, let him have it. Let him have it. Jay, go in. I'm a good ass off of a bitch. Mm. Just. You got jawline. Oh, yeah, that haircut. This scar makes me look dangerous. No, I do. <laughs> Please no, move I on. Do. My <laughs> God. A pile of Jesus next Christ. Mm. <laughs> mm. Gillian, yeah. you swim to the bottom. Um, Make, uh, an, <laughs> make a perception check. It'll be easy enough. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh wait, that's the wrong one. That's the wrong one. All right, I rolled. I rolled a sixteen plus perceptions plus one, so I got a seventeen. Plenty. Yeah. Uh, you get. Uh, it's okay. <clears throat> Once you get to the floor uh, of this pond, you see, uh, sort of just kind of like taped, um, to the ground here, uh, just uh, a picture. Oh. You can't quite make out like what it is. You can just tell that it's a it's a piece of parchment that kind of resembles uh, that of like a photo. 
Uh, it has some kind of marking or drawing on it, but you can't like, it's in the water. It's just a little dark down here now, so you can't like make it up. You'd have to take the, it up uh, there. Is that the only thing in, in here? Down yeah. here? Yeah, 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 yeah. Strapped uh, to the bottom of the floor of this pond. Okay. Which is um, probably, probably about like 40, deep, 40 feet deep. Yeah, I'll pick it up. I'll pick it up for sure. Yep. Easy enough. I, you I, just easy enough? Okay, I'm mm -hmm. going to start swimming uh, upwards again. See if I can get a good uh, look at look at this thing. Okay. Uh, would you look at it when you got out of the pond or just look at it as you're swimming up? I'd look at it probably when, when there's enough light. Would he I disrupt think. my gaze? I mean, as you're swimming up... I swim up, up and now all Chip sees is Gillian Tidestrider in his no. reflection. <laughs> as you're swimming up, you can see looking over the pond, uh, just kind of in a conversation, Chip and Jay looking down. Uh, they just seem to be so talking nice to each other and not look out. Yeah, God, you're just looking, looking, looking down. Uh, you look... You look the like way they're looking, that fell like, off the ceiling. Like, Damn, mm. are they checking me out? <laughs> <laughs> they they look you put in like love. A fucking you're so unnoticeable. Jay. I could... I could step up on you and I wouldn't even notice. Ass. Oh shit, I look good. Chosen for a reason, have you seen these packs? Oh <laughs> shit! Gil, get out of the oh, way! Oh shit, guys! <laughs> yeah, I, I, the I, way. Look at the, I look at the photo, I look at the photo. Okay, I'll say that you emerge uh, from from the water here uh, in, in your Gillian Tide Strider fashion. Don't even need to use your hands to just <laughs> dolphin out of the water. Uh, and dolphin then you bad. sit on the edge with your legs in the water and you're, you're looking at the photo covering... Um, your vision of your own reflection at this time. <laughs> um, <coughs> and you see that the photo is almost a... It's of two humanoids. It's a perfect reenactment re of the uh, the marking on the wall. It's the same pose. It looks like a a, a, a masculine and a, figure, a feminine figure. One that's just extremely broad. Uh, a stand, or, or kneeling down uh, in front of this much smaller uh, stature of a human. Uh, the face is blacked out. You can't really see like who uh, this this photo or, or drawing would be of. Uh, and if you uh, roll, roll, just roll an investigation check. Sure. Yeah, I, I, I look around see if there's anything else to the photo. Yeah, I figured. I okay, figured. and I got a three. Okay. Well, it's, it's easy <laughs> enough because uh, if you <laughs> if you're flipping like the photo around and stuff, on the very back, uh, written uh, across the the back of this uh, like photo pamphlet of sorts. Uh, just says, God, I would make out with me. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what it says? <laughs> no. Uh, right before your thoughts are cut off by uh, Jay's uh, professing of her own self-love, uh, it just says, perform an act of love with an exclamation mark. Uh, no wonder everyone I ever loved left me. I wouldn't want to live in this shadow either. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> hey, and now uh, you get, you can hear that the two of them are simultaneously complimenting themselves repeatedly, but also uh, so digging into each other as well. <laughs> I'm so I, you, fine. you both, you both look, everyone looks great here, especially you, <laughs> Pretzel. But I think I found a hint, Jay, look at this. I put, I put it in front of her face. No one loves me, I'm it. too hot. I swat it, I swat it. <laughs> uh, Jay, Jay, it's, it's... Jay, make a wisdom saving throw as he, as he uh, blocks your vision. Oh, okay, let's see if I do it this time. 13, does that save it? No. Absolutely not. So, uh, you swat no, out the photo out of the here. way, looking, and then you just the watch. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Jay, you start to actually get even closer to your own reflection. One second, I gotta I nail gotta, down, I and you just get in there. I start crawling in the water. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> um, Jay, are you all right? Wow, she just looks so good. I could, I could, I could eat her up. Eventually, everyone will leave because I'm too hot. Oh, ch ch Chip, what do you make of this? I, I show him the photo. <laughs> the only thing I want to make is out with me. Chip, I right, right, use that one, you idiot. Like, I know, down. I know exactly what I'm gonna do if you fail. <laughs> okay, okay. Some okay. Well, I'm not very good at. Oh, natural twenty. Ooh. You best. Yo, okay. you come back to your senses and realize that. Uh, your reflection was charming you. The existential dread that, that took over me and the self-loathing <laughs> that it became just starts to take over. And the, like, and the fuck boy crying just turns to normal crying. <laughs> the tears in your eyes make it too blurry to see your own reflection. <laughs> I grab onto Gil. Just... Hey, man. Hey, buddy. Chip. We're all alone in this world. Go oh, fish and chips, right, man? Or what happened? Eventually, I'll just be chipped. Did something happen with this with this pool? I look over the edge of my own reflection. 
Uh, you would be you would be making a wisdom save with the advantage uh, since you have already passed it. Oh, okay, 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 okay. All right, first one is a all right natural twenty. Oh Jesus! <laughs> you you unfortunately pass. Damn, I was chosen for a fucking reason. Hot shit. All right, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> It says here we need to perform an act of love, Chip. To What's pass, happening? it seems. Jay, what are yeah, you come doing? Here. Come here, buddy. Whoa, she's going in. <laughs> yeah, at this point, uh, drown Jay would be slipping so into cool. the water. Uh, and and as, soon as, as soon as you enter the water under this spell, Jay, your body would lock up into a sort of paralysis, and you would start to sink to the bottom. Okay, ah, uh, Chip, we need to perform, I think, an act of love. Everyone it looks like he's hugging good. I, I'm hugging Chip. I'm looking around. <laughs> so, Jay is just sinking into the pond now. I know, I know. Is hugging him doing anything? Not at the very moment. <laughs> okay, I kiss him on the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Performance check. But oh, to show how, how genuine the kiss is. Twenty. We need to do this. Natural twenty. No. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, did you both roll natural twenty? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what? You both got twenty. Holy fuck! Yes. Oh my fucking god. Fishy cheers, baby. Fucking believe Fish that. I I literally I fucking lean him down. Fish and shit. <laughs> Kill all this shit. is not allowed. <laughs> this is illegal. Jay, this Jay, be, be glad that you're currently drowning so you don't have to see this. <laughs> what, did this. Did this like open a door or anything? Did this do it? Please tell me this did something. Please tell me this was like fucking, I'm just like fucking stunned <laughs> like straight face. I, need, looking at I like, need this to oh be. Oh god. And that should have done it. As your yep. guys, as both of your gazes meet each other, the sparkle lights up in Gill's eyes, and he goes in as he grabs the back of your head and pulls oh, it in. And, 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 I hate <laughs> how descriptive this is. <laughs> <laughs> what a fan. <laughs> he pulls it in, and in this embrace, your lips touch together. Stop explaining. And the magic flows into the room. <laughs> You guys start to hear a of stone uh, splitting. And you look over and you start to see that the where the drawing was being was on the wall. A crack <laughs> forms in between the two. I don't notice. <laughs> and it starts to open. <laughs> However, it start, they, they start to separate. The person My kneeling God. and the person standing, they start to separate as it seems to be opening into an entrance. However, Jay is still... Drowning. Oh, just oh, drowning. Oh, okay, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, I, gen I gently, I gently set, set Chip down. Chip, you're, you're just frozen. Gently lay him down. We it did was it. a. Did, did what? And then I and then I and then I jump in. I'm going for Jai. Chip, you regrettably, this is regrettably the best kiss. I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. Of your life. I didn't do you anything. You understand? <laughs> <laughs> regrettably, blah, 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 the best blah, 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 blah. kiss you've ever had. Now, my hands are up in the air. I'm just, you know, I'm like, I didn't, I didn't do this. Gillian, this you hop into the pond. <laughs> gotta do what you gotta do, baby. You, hop in the pond. What did you do? What did, what did, I'm all right. Flower said had said something about, and then it was this was part of plan. I, I didn't plan for this. So as you uh, <laughs> as you did. grab uh, Jay and you uh, take her and you guys swim to the the surface. As soon as you guys break the water and and Jay, you're you're removed from the water and you're you're put on your back. You're facing towards the ceiling of this room. You also hear the the cracking and and, and grinding of stone as it starts to open. Uh, the spell for you is broken. You can no longer see yourself and no longer in the pond. Jay, are you all right? Jay, <coughs> slap, her, slap her across the face a couple times. <coughs> ah! Ow! Stop it was that. An, it Ow. was an act of love, Jay, to open the door. Wow! Incredible. Oh! Is that what slapping is? No, no, we already country? we already got the door open. Don't worry, we solved the puzzle. Yeah, don't worry about it. Don't worry. We're just gonna go through the door mean? and then walk to the. What does that mean? You guys, what you guys no, make? No, we just love you so much that we got you out, and you're here now, and now the door's open, and we're gonna go through it, Jay. We're yes. gonna go through it. 
And you're gonna say <laughs> yes to what Chip is and saying. I'm gonna or walk to what? right through and I gonna get my crutches and I start like moving <laughs> like hastily yeah. moving through. So uh you see that the the pathway Truly that has been this, revealed the sanctuary tests our bonds, Jay. Let's go. <laughs> the exit No uh, bonds, no bonds is created by the couple that was once drawn together being separated. Uh, and in front of you is another staircase, this time, again, curving in the opposite direction of the one that you came in, but still going up. The stone uh, begins to have that same marble uh, color as, as the buildings and stuff and like the palace that you've seen before and the overgrowth uh, from the grass in this chamber begins to uh, creep over the, the steps itself and up the walls again as it seems to return to the same uh, environment that you are, you are used to. You guys Stay go on steps, your right? guard. We know not what, what evils we may what face if it, What if it's more good, though? What if it's more good? What if it's a good place again? I can't deal with that. I can't, st I can't deal with the peaceful eyes. I know. I know. You guys enter a third chamber. Uh, uh, contrary to Chip's eyes, which <laughs> look very <just> scared. <laughs> Looks very Chaotic. distraught. Is, are you, you talking? Okay? I'm just wanting, I just want to get us out of here and save the island. Chip. 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 <laughs> needed to solve the puzzle. What was needed? Oh, we, we solved it, and it's solved done, it, and it's over, Gil, and it's done. What's the next one thing that we're <laughs> going to do together? Okay, yeah, yeah, we got Not to together like that, right. like that. I just mean, like, what are we going to... Hey, Jay. As friends. Hey, Chip. So, you guys <laughs> um, <laughs> travel up these steps now. And you enter the third chamber. And you're out with a room uh, made of a mixture of this marble stone and sandstone. Or sandstone. Uh, there's remnants of gold. Uh, there's some, some chalices, other treasure just kind of scattered amongst the floor. Uh, a bit of the, the vines are, over, are growing over these uh, small bits of like jewelry and whatnot. And it's covering the walls which are also made of this mixture of sandstone uh and, and marble and oh. at the very end at the back wall as you come into this room you see in the shape of a coffin mounted to the wall of overgrowth this wall having the thickest vines some of it even looking like tree branches coming out uh, or being uh, embedded into the wall itself, keeping, uh, seeming to keep this coffin held or, or onto the wall. <clears throat> it's open. And as you guys get closer, you see that inside is a mummified skeleton with an array of golden chains, necklaces, jewelry on the fingers still. And it's holding an item. A black with gold trimming. No. 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 <laughs> Wait. Dude, you said black and I was like, no fucking way. Wait, please what did you think it was for just a moment. Oh, you think it's the... <laughs> I thought it was going to be like the egg. No, I was no, like, no, no. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> Sorry. You guys got so fucking scared for a second. No. It's holding a black in the same, for us, uh, in the same color scheme. A black mm -hmm. square-like item with kind of like gold, um, I'll just say trimming on the edges of it. If you guys go up to inspect it, you would notice that it's a compass. Is this what we're looking for? Make an Arcana check, Jay. Awesome. Why do I suck? Seven. <laughs> okay. Um. There's this very, very faint sense of magical energy coming from it, but you can't tell how much or where it's from. You just know that it's in the room and it gets stronger the closer that you get uh, to this coffin. I it's want to um magical. I want to use divine sense again. Uh, detect some good and evil. A any celestial fiend undead within 60 feet or any, any any anything, any vibes, any good or evil vibes. No undead. No celestials, no fiends. I'm so scared. To, I'm so scared to touch this thing. No evil. No, no, no great sense of evil, I, I suppose. Jay, what 
Is this what we were, we're looking for? I I think so. It, it seems magical. I, I mean, it. just poke it. Okay, you poke it. I mean, it's fairly sturdy, and the and the skeleton, the mummified skeleton's grasp. As I kind of holding it, so Indiana holding it, uh, kind of holding it near his chest, almost. As I poke it, I jump back and put my hands up like I'm gonna fight it. <laughs> you get in this boxing, <laughs> uh, this boxing stance, but you can't move your legs. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen ancient. I, I've read tomes of ancient traps that use uh, contraptions to detect weight. Hmm. Maybe if we switch it out for something else. Hey, wait, I read that too. Wait, can I... I have a question. I have a real question. Uh, I know I did an Arcana check, but is it possible for me to do a history check and see if I know anything... Maybe of this color scheme or, like, of ancient artifacts of this, like... If you want to roll a history check, you can. Okay. Absolutely try. <laughs> Why do I suck? <laughs> Seven again? <laughs> yeah, same so, roll. Um... There's nothing special about the color scheme specifically, uh, and uh, to you, it, it just has, it has the appearance of a compass. Okay. There is no, yeah, you don't you don't get anything Here's as far as history goes. Here's I'd like I to do. Oh, hold on, can I? <coughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, yeah, yeah. I have uh, I have an oil flask. Uh, I wanna I wanna pull it out. See, would it be comparable weight to the uh, to the thing? A what flask? Oil flask. Uh, you could try. Would it be comparable I, I... weight to a just a normal, like? Compass that I would have held before. Would I would would I just not know? An oil flask would probably be heavier, but pretzel, pretzel. What's the vibe? Pretzel looks around, kind of spinning a few times every time uh, she switches directions. She just looks up. Uh, her eyes kind of at the corner, looks up at you, kind of lay uh, her floats to where her her back is facing the ground. She looks up, and you can tell that and pretzel is just kind of uncertain, a little anxious. Okay, Chip, I will leave this to you if this is... I, I, There's no way. This seems like a trick again. Yeah, it's too easy, right? It's Guys, I right mean, here. come on. We can just inspect the panel. I mean, make out with Chip. <laughs> stop, stop. <laughs> <laughs> there's only one way. Just mm. take a look at the panel. See if there's a pressure plate. Usually they're noticeable. I want, to, I want to inspect the surrounding area. See if there's another either like... A way, a different way out of here, or like a uh, any kind of. I want to inspect for traps, essentially, a traps or or where an actual treasure might be. Roll an investigation check. Okay, we so don't trust this thing, man. Yeah, that is a twenty-one. You looking around the room? Don't get any um, leftover inclinations of like traps. Uh, there is no other exit in the room. It's the same as last room. There was the way that you came in. And as far as uh, you can tell, there is nothing, uh, another way that you can that you can leave. However, as you're inspecting the surrounding area, there are remnants of stone, kind of shaped like fingers or other body parts, but broken up into little pieces. Mm. And there are scrapes, gashes. Some some vines are severed in places, seeming to just grow back. Okay, I have a feeling we might have to fight something. So just like, I'm gonna swap it out. Just get ready to fight. That I can do. Swap that bitch, Chip. Also, just kind of pull me back a little bit when I do this. I always okay. smile when you grab the sword. <laughs> <laughs> I, get, I get ready to uh, I get ready to pull him back when he All when right. he takes this. Uh, if the if I feel like the oil flask might be a little too heavy, I'll pour some of it out until I I feel like it would be comparable weight, and then I want to very quickly switch it out. Okay. Mm, sleight of hand. Roll. Right? Roll sleight of hand. Holy fuck! That's a nine. That's a two plus seven. Fuck. Chip. You approach the coffin with your crutches slowly hopping over, and you slowly begin to move your hand towards uh, the black and gold compass. And you grab it, and you try to... Sw <laughs> you try to very... aggressively, quickly, in a snappy motion, switch the two. When you go to move the black and gold compass, it doesn't budge. And the coffin yep, and 
Door no. slams shut. Make a dexterity saving throw. Oh god, okay. Oh shit. Ooh. But, but but with my legs? Disadvantage. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> well, that is, I don't know how it can get worse. It got worse, natural one. It's <laughs> <laughs> a good natural one? Oh, fuck, dude. Okay. That's why you never say anything. I got a three, and then I said it can't get worse. I shouldn't have said uh, that. All right, yeah, it's not bad. You take uh, three points of bludgeoning damage as the coffin door slams shut and catches a bit of your your, your fingers. Um, and as oh, this happens... Oh! <laughs> you see on the face of the coffin as it slams shut, and you guys pull Chip back as fingers being smashed slightly. On the face of this coffin is a large skull with glowing gem eyes. Vines begin to grow rapidly up the walls and around the coffin. And then you hear whip sounds as they start to snap and detach from the wall. And the coffin itself begins to lean forward. And from the bottom of the wall, large trunk vines Trunk-shaped vines begin to emerge and attach itself to the bottom of the coffin. And in one motion, as dust flies through the floor past your feet, you are met with this large, with the body of this coffin, a vine vegetation monstrosity. Is it our boy? I is, it our, is it have gentle eyes? I knock an arrow, this one doesn't have gentle eyes. <laughs> the eyes of the skull, the glowing green gems, send a bright green wave of energy. No. A gentle one? <laughs> no. And everybody Not... has I'm to make it in advance. God, a constitution fuck. saving throw. Oh wait, constitution? Oh, I'm good at that. Still pretty shit. Natural 20. Not great at that. Let's give it a shot. 23. Uh, okay, I got a, I got a 12, but I'm gonna use, uh, favored by the gods to add 2d4 to it, so I have a 12 hey, can the plus... gods favor me too? I don't think so. <laughs> well, okay, 12 not? plus 6. Okay, that brings it up to an 18. I got a, I got a 9. Chip. Instinctively. You lovers duke it out. <laughs> as soon as this bright glow begins to get a little bit too bright, and right before the, the wave, uh, the blast, uh, of energy hits... You avert your gaze and um, hop to turn around from it. Uh, and nothing directly happens to you, but as you move your head to your left, you notice that Jay and Gillian actually a natural one because of the divine prophecy. <laughs> Yeah, no. you fucked. Uh, <laughs> I forgot about that. The two of you God. start to feel the same feeling of fl of stone creeping up your flesh, and that is where we're going to end the session. God damn it! That's uh, that was perfect. Where we will roll grizzly. initiative, <laughs> <laughs> and combat will ensue. Ah. Uh. Just roll with it. The f featuring Conda Fiction, I, I guess. Yeah. Why are patrons? And they are so cool. Are so cool. You got people like Skywalker Dreamer. Obligatory references. And Ben Ten Cross on a Sim. Doritos, Jazzy, Big Piper. If I told you we have patrons, they pay us fifty dollars, and then I say their name in this outro thing. It's pretty fucking cool. Thank you for the money. I really appreciate it because then we're gonna get an office and we're gonna do some cool shit in that office. It's gonna be great. This isn't the song. This is just me rambling now. That's fine though, because who really cares? All you care about is hearing your name in a funny sound, and uh, maybe that's what really matters at the end of the day. Because we got people like Uranus and Cakes and Viridin. And Cat aesthetic and creepy reaper. Cake vape master 69. Oh yeah! Kirby Wap Bro and Luna Surfy. 
king of French, and I don't read or acknowledge. Serene is actually a skeleton. When I, blah, 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 blah. I didn't read that one properly, clearly. <laughs> this is one take. I can't take it back, really, so I guess I'll just give it another try. Shit. Uni Yaloon, got it, I think. That's pretty close, I guess. Gillian's biggest fan, and Resh is snivy. Cornier Comet, and Jumpy is Venus 34. Your gal pal, Valerie B. Edgy Moss, Charm of the Bard, and Riker Career of Two. Zigzag Sugar, Nong Zolotl, Asteria Nix, and Salutation. JRWI, Enjoyer, and Jay Newell. And that's all of them. Uh, goodbye.